Hello guys, this is Kika here, bringing you a new episode of Epic Seven video. Today we'll be debuting the Mortalix, right? The newest Husbando Dragon, a five-star hero. Uh, if you like the video, please make sure to click on the like button and subscribe for more future content. Without further ado, let's get into the video. So Mortalix, right, is a knight right over here, right? Very cool looking, right? Uh, he's an earth knight, but right, as you can see here, a lot of like a blue color. So I don't know what's going on, right, at Smallgate. Like the this color mismatch, right? Same thing happened with Landy, right? Landy had a lot of like uh, fire elements, right, in the design. Okay, let's look at the skills, right? Advent Mortalix, right? This skill animation wise is look at this. Strip of the shirt, right? Oh my god, this is like insane. Like one of the probably one of the better looking S3, right? I really like this animation. Like it, it looks so cool, right? You feel that power right, of the dragon. And not to mention that the S1, S1 is also very solid, right? Like, you know, spin that spear, right? Spin that weapon. And for his skill set, I think he's very unique. Uh, Mortalix, right? S3, right over here, right? Uh, decrease max health of the target by up to 15% every time this skill is used. And it's like an injury effect, right? And this scale with his max HP, so you want him to be as high health as possible and to destroy the enemy max HP. So this makes him good to fight against, you know, tanky teams, right? And uh, once you use this skill a couple of terms, they, are, like, they have like a very low max health already. And you can finish them off very, very easily. And this skill grants him like the rage buff, increase attack and speed by 10%. This is like a small buff, right? Not big deal. So overall, I think uh, it's a very solid, right? S3. And uh, so he's S2 right over here, right? Uh, immune to stun and sleep, anti-control, and also increased critical heat resistance, anti-creep buff and speed buff, right? Uh... But this can only be activated if, if you crit, so you want to build him with high crit chance. And it's only 30% though, so if you max this, max all of this, it becomes 40%. So it's like a RNG factor right over here. Yeah? S1, right? Probably one of the better S1, right? Armor break for 50% chance if you max. 2 plus 3. Ignore effective resistance if he's in range. Uh, of course, after he uses S his S3, he's going to be having this rage buff. So this is huge because it allows you to armor break like a high effective resistance unit like a Ruel, Magic Scholar Doris, right? Or a Momo. And uh, it can come in clutch, right? In PvP. So I think uh, overall, like he has some solid skills. So uh, let's test him out in Guild World, right? I have him on a speed and uh, crit set build. Um, it's very average gear and I don't have like a Albert's Ritual Sword and I'm using Proof of Valor. So ideally you want to use Albert's Ritual Sword to give that like counter chance, right? To proc the if more effective resistant S1. You want him to be on high crit chance to proc S2 and also high speed to cycle that like injury like S3, right? Uh, overall, I think uh, you should be able to uh, build him with high HP, right? To scale that damage. Okay, let's get into Guild War. So first fight, we have like this Mortalix against the Double Knights team, right? Uh, for the bottom team below. Okay, for the top team, we have like a uh, Remnant Violet. This one should be easy, right? It's not about like the, the, the guild fight today. It's more about the, how Mortalix perform. Here we kill the Violet. 
Rylet. Ooh, what is this? The Green Pergus and... And... Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, we don't need Rose anyway, right? Like, she can die here. And, uh, yeah, we should seal the deal, right? Okay, this Green Pergus, though. Popping off. Okay, can we kill here? No, right? Not with defense buff. We got another counter. I always thought that, like Green Pergis is actually really good. But I haven't had time to build mine, right? The resource to build mine. I'll probably do that in the future. Okay, for this one. Ooh! What? A time was so fast. Okay, we didn't get stunned. Right? Okay, so as you can see here, it's a very tanky lineup. The ML crowd, the A Taiwan, and the Charles. So we do this strip of the shirt. Yeah? Injured them. Okay, look at what? It's like 2000 damage. Okay, are we dead here? No way, right? So we horse. And we horse. No, it looks really bad. Okay, Ravi got a counter. And uh, this is very unfortunate because they have like uh, all full immunity, so we cannot armor break. Okay, I think we killed the. Oh, no, 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 no. I think we killed the Charles right over here, right? Our crowd is probably dead, but. It's okay, as long as uh, Mortalix survived, right? Look at that, it brought this anti-creep buff. And we still got crit, okay. This is a lie. Okay, I think we win this. No, no, wait, horse again? Wait, 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 no, 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 no. More than this, more than this. Okay, it, oh no. But I have to save him, I have to save him, right? Because I want to use him in future vice. I'm sorry I'm ending in Guild War, but like, you know, it's all about the more today, so. Okay, for our second fight, we fight Momo and the Prowl with more So for this top team, we should be able to finish this really quickly because we have top model Luluka, right? We have to armor break this up to Vyuja, just to make sure, right? Just in case he's tanky. Tanky counter Arbiter, right? So we kill here so he cannot revive. This has to kill. Okay, okay. Okay, we work on the well. Yeah, we work on the well next and then we try to get another armor break with Falcon of Curry and finish the uh, ML can. Do we get an armor break right over here? Oh, we got an armor break. Okay, this should kill, right? Okay, nice. No, no. Okay, we didn't get countered. Can we kill here? With the armor break. Oh, no, 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 no. Ooh. Okay, we barely survived. That was close. That was close. We almost lost that one. Okay, Mortelix, second fight. So he lost one already. So can he pull this one off? Right, one very interesting certain synergy, right? If you have like Mortelix on Albert's Ritual Sword, you can like counter into a Charles proc, right? Two Albert's armor break, and then Charles immediately deleted someone right? into the armor break. So here, I think we work on the. Uh, Kill the 
green violet for us to try to. Okay, Momo heals herself. How should I do this? And okay, goes on to the crowd. Yeah, that's fine. So can we armor break? Oh, we can't. I'll show you how it's done. How nice, correct posture. Okay. If you're ready, let's go. Nice. We we work on this. We work on this, and we try to kill him ASAP. Yeah. And we got horse. Okay, nice, Charles. Correct postures. Okay, he dead. Nice. But it's not about Mortadix, right? It's the Charles doing the work. Can we get an armor break? No, he can't. Okay, at, at this point, this is a win because there's no damage threat already. It was deleted by Charles. Yeah, we can work, work on her and then we force the crown. No! Stop healing! Okay, this should kill. Okay, we, 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 we one more turn, we one more turn. You know, I just feel like something is missing in his kit. You know? Maybe give him like a healing on S2. Or something, right? Like, it's a bit like last. And destroy HP, it doesn't even destroy that much. And it's good against healing only. If the enemy is, say for example in this case, the crowd cannot, can't even go back to that full HP. So, yeah, okay, we got the win with Mortenix. Okay, for our last fight, we're gonna fight the Dark Corvus defense right over here with Mortenix. So, for, oh no, for like for this one, I forgot to bring the, the book, right? If we don't double up, we're gonna be in trouble. Let's go double up. Nice, nice. We got lucky here. Yeah, so this one is pretty much a win. Right? We just already deleted the Tempest Suit. So. Okay, we continue, right? Oh, this Lilius is a fast Lilius. Push our back. Okay, we step on them. Max HP damage. Oh, what? Only 300. 600. Like, what? Almost no damage, though. Like, what's going on? Okay, Landy. They're very tanky. This team is very tanky. So can Mortalix, you know, maybe cycle enough turn to, you know, destroy their HP so that uh, we slowly wearing them down, right? Nice defense break. The problem is Landy is provoked. Maybe I shouldn't bring Landy here, bring like a water threat so that Lilius cannot, you know, go out to Landy. And asleep. Whoa! <laughs> what? This A Momo is sleeping everyone today, right? Everyone goes to sleep. This is not looking good. This is not looking good. Can we still win this though? Like I don't I don't know. Like because Dark Covers will have like the ultimate up, right? Very soon. 
and we got provoked it again. This is not looking good. This is you know, more to the side. Doesn't do enough damage. Okay, no, no, no. No, we have to provoke here. Provoke. No. I th I think we lose because Dark Horus has the thing. Has the thing. Look at that, only 1000 damage, like, what do you mean? No! <laughs> oh, Landy! Oh, Landy got destroyed. No... Yeah, we lose this one. That's all the time I have for you guys today. Overall, I think Mortalis is a little bit like Luster. Not gonna lie, I think like with I'm kind of sad because of his you know the art style is really good, but like the kid is like it's not like the skill sets are not very powerful, right? I was expecting more power uh, within his abilities, but it turns out to be not that great. I mean, I'm sure like people will have him molded and then. Uh, he can perform his niche job, right? Anti CC and, uh, you know, destroy HP, right? Uh, but I still doubt it, right? Like, definitely not not like an OP character as like Seaside Bologna, right? Uh, yeah. So if you like the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. And with that being said, I hope you guys all have a great day, and I will see you guys next time.